What's up everyone? We're back with another break. Uh, so we're doing Pokemon again. Um, so we have this pack here, pretty special pack. There's uh, two cards in this pack. Series five, pop five, a little additional expansion uh, for the series five. So uh, two cards, uh, Espeon and Umbreon in here that go for hundreds of dollars. Uh, so we're gonna try and pull that. There's 17 possible cards that came in these. So uh, just a little under 12% that we're gonna pull the car we want. So we're gonna do that. I got this from a legit uh, broker online. So um, we're gonna do that at the end of this video. What we're gonna do for the main part of this quick video, a little twofer, is I bought this um, GX 15 pack booster pack online when I first started making videos um, during this uh, new time in 2020 that we were all going through looking for something to fill my time. And turned out the first box was fake right over here and i started doing more research to kind of find out of course i was new to the pokemon culture as a whole but also um so you know i saw online it's like 20 bucks I was like oh that's a pretty good deal 15 packs you know give me something to do and uh, i learned my lesson so i do have some real breaks on here but uh this came in i ordered this before uh, i found out that my first set was fake so we're gonna open this we're gonna look for what the what to look for kind of what i learned along the way and then after we open up see all the great hits i mean the hits in this are insane because they want you to keep ordering uh and then after i open up uh these we're gonna open up this real pack to kind of cap off the video so you get a little um some stuff that i learned plus uh just some pack opening and then something pretty awesome that uh if we get the right hit the right card it's gonna be pretty epic um you know kind of hard to think to open this pack but that's what they're there for that's what the channel's about um not just collectors but we also uh break things together so uh these are in japanese so i'm not going to be able to pronounce all the different um all the different pokemon but getting a little better like i said leveling up slowly but surely so let's go ahead and break into these and I'll, I'll show you a couple things that I learned uh, along the way here. So, for one, this pack is a Japanese set of GX. The Japanese GX cards have gold borders. So even though this looks really good, like the dark uh, darkness here, you know, they're getting really, really uh, sophisticated with their fakes. The Japanese set like this is supposed to have gold borders with four little colored balls uh around the back side so you got a japanese uh front set and an uh, american back set so that was one of the first clues that i got uh along with um a couple other indicators that we'll go through uh once we go through these so I'm just gonna have rip through these pretty quick and then we'll get to that series five pop five and hopefully we can make this uh pretty short video you know i'm I, I had to come in. I mean, I'm not going to argue with uh, counterfeiters. So, you know, it was on me, of course, but don't want you to make the same mistake, especially since, you know, you know, don't want you to get into the same, uh, same issues. So that's uh, a couple of our cards there that uh, actually didn't get anything good. Anyways, the first one I opened, we were getting <laughs> some ridiculous cards. So maybe we'll pull a, a Charizard out of here, a fake one, unfortunately. It'd be nice to pull even a fake one, though. So... Let's go through, see if we get anything special out of here. So there's a hollow, there's a hollow. Nothing amazing yet, even with them being not real. So a couple of things I learned, I actually should have grabbed some of the real ones I, I just purchased not too long ago and opened on this channel. You can watch that uh, later. Is uh, the weight was different. And uh, I guess we'll just go ahead and go through this and then we'll uh, I'll show you a couple couple things. So. Um, that's kind of a cool art that, like I said, super sophisticated with their fakes now. So this card, this card looks pretty good, right? F uh, wrong back. And then you'll see some of the professionals will rip them. And there's like a Pokemon cards get printed on three layers of paper and the middle is always blue or black, but mostly black, right? So if you were to tear this in half, you should see white, black, white, or white, blue, white, but mostly black. So let's go ahead and tear this one in half, see what we get. So no coloring in there. So not uh, not a real card. And then actually what you'll see with these is that they're actually like 
uh, foiled, I ripped it pretty good, but they're actually like foil stickers, see, on these uh, cardboard stocks. See that? So uh, that's another fake. Of course, I ripped a, a normal fake one. And the, and the industry is so huge. It's insane. Like the, the seller of these on eBay had thousands of positive reviews. Um, I, I think a lot of people don't really understand they have fake Pokemon cards. Um, Cause just so many variations, so many printed. So one wrong back, uh, but some of the telltale signs of the back was that this blue border would be lighter, but this one's pretty dark. So you can see they're getting better, but they're printing them so rapidly when things are hot that they can't pay attention to every detail. And also it costs money if you're gonna switch up for every single, besides the, the paper in between, if you're gonna switch up for every single variation, you're printing all these backs, you know, it's just too much money. So they're banking on the fact of uh, people like me trying to get into it or uh, people not paying attention. I broke that first box on here. Um, and uh, I had people who knew Pokemon pretty well. And they basically, I was like, hey, I think these are fake. And they're like, what do you mean? And I explained some of the stuff that I saw online from some of the big uh, Pokemon breakers, uh, Real Brick Nade and Lionheart and uh, Triple AD Pokemon and stuff. And basically, uh, I was telling them that I saw some things and then I was like, and the backs are wrong. And they were like, I didn't even notice. So even people who are avid collectors uh, don't, uh, don't understand. So that right there, this is our shiny rare card. So pretty epic. And then look at this. Holy smokes. Can you believe we got one of these? I can't believe it either. Uh, even feels textured. Um, it's so, uh, the hit, we should get a lot more hits out of this 15 card pack because they riddle it with uh, pretty amazing cards here and there, but you will get a few. We'll keep that on screen so you can see uh, how awesome it is. So they'll riddle you with uh, some of these so that you can continue to go back and buy, which I did. I was 100% one of those people. Um, and like I said, I'm not upset about it. Like, it's not great, you know, you know, learning lesson, especially when you're trying to get into uh, different hobbies and stuff and you earn, earn your stripes. And now I know better and I'm paying much more attention. So I'm able to share that with you along with, uh, <coughs> you know, actually getting into the right hobby, the right cards, the right way. So. Not fantastic. Of course, you don't want to throw away money, but um, you know, there was a pretty big lesson learned. So I guess, you know, you want to pay for education. There it is. So that's a pretty good card. Um, I know that that one could be worth a few shekels if it was real. And there's a couple other special cards. So we got uh, like five packs left and then we're going to rip into that uh, special pack, the real one. And we'll call it a video. I mean, pretty excited so if you are new to the channel we do box breaks of every type of thing on here so we appreciate your support if you want to hit that thumbs up and hit that subscribe button we do pokemon probably once or twice a month uh just because oh my goodness look at that shiny card just because we are uh getting our feet wet so you know we're not trying to overwhelm ourselves uh, over here uh, also if you uh like pokemon specifically there's a new channel uh that just uh, started not too long ago that I really enjoy. It's a triple AD Pokemon. Uh, some pretty cool professionals over there talking about uh, hobbies for mental health, which this uh, hobby totally is about. And then of course, doing box breaks, talking about Pokemon, talking about the culture, do little podcast style rips, uh, a couple guys over there. So pretty fun, entertaining. If you're interested, check them out. Uh, they're pretty, pretty entertaining and you know, it's nice that they're really uh, honest about the hobby and some of the shortcomings. So, bam, right there. There's a GX. Pretty cool looking card. So, we are we are killing it. We got a shiny up there. We got one of those extra secret rares up there. Uh, all these great, great cards that, unfortunately, you could still, I would never do this, but you could still sell and people just don't know the difference. They don't pay attention, maybe a couple avid collectors. And I totally get it, you know, um, especially being new. So, you know, real for me, they have no value other than this video and uh, little education. All right, last two packs, then we're gonna get into that super duper ultra special pack. Um, and another shiny right there. So we got a couple of those shinies. So we can keep those on here. 
I mean, if you don't care, I mean, they're getting pretty dang good at uh, making these. I mean, the packs look legit. The foil at the top and the bottom was looking pretty good. Um, the This used to look fake on fake packs. Now it looks legit. So they're, they're doing the right work in order to, you know, the sales on it is probably astronomical. So it's uh, too bad, but, you know, live and learn and we'll all get there. All right, so last pack, and then we're gonna get into that uh, extra special pack that is gonna break some hearts when I open. However, we gotta see, I'm still curious. I'm just too curious about this pack. So those were our hits right there, our, uh, our fake hits. Amazing, right? Can't believe it, we did it. We got those, those great cards. Um, so this I got from a legit broker, came in certified mail. We're looking for one, uh, two cards. There's two cards in here, and we're only looking for two cards. So you can see this pack contains two cards from Pokemon uh, Organized Play Series 5 Expansion. You can see all the little details there. See how that looks. So I don't want to bend it too much, but admire the pack a little bit because this was, uh, well, probably, <laughs> probably about to see me lose a little bit of money here if we don't pull those cards, so. Let's go ahead and let's just do it. I'm gonna do this a little off screen. Oh, I think you might have saw that one. I saw it as well. So we'll go ahead and bring it back in frame. We got Pikachu. So that's our first card. Uh, I'm not sure, not this one, but the other one I think goes for a few bucks. So I think this was like 30, this one's probably worth like a few dollars. And a trainer card. So right there, that's how you throw away a little bit of money. Uh, thanks for joining me. Like I said, if you like these types of videos and breaks, like we're going to do more real Pokemon, of course, and some educational stuff. So if you could hit that uh, like button and then subscribe, um, we appreciate it. And we'll see you on the next break. Bye bye.